Hello, I'm Andrew and welcome to Sid Meier's Civilization VI Gathering Storm. We played a bit recently on the channel demonstrating some of the new stuff in the uh, new Frontier pack. And after doing that sponsor video, I was like, I want to play more Civilization. So I may have played quite a bit offline. And then after asking Twitter, Twitter were like, yeah, just make a series. So that's what we're going to be doing. We're going to be playing a new game as... Uh, where... Who, who is it I've been playing a lot of recently? It is John Curtin of Australia. And we'll bump the difficulty up to... I could go Emperor! This is a bit risky. I'm going to go King for now. If we want to do another uh, game afterwards, we can do another playthrough on uh, Emperor. I'm, I'm definitely nowhere near Deity. Definitely nowhere near Deity. Uh, we'll do Continents. We will play a standard map, I think. Won't play Apocalypse Mode, and we'll leave Disaster Intensity at 2. I'm tempted to turn it up, because disasters are quite fun. But for now, we'll just leave it at 2. Uh, right, so John Curtin of Australia. Citadel of Civilization, plus 100% production if they have either received a declaration of war or liberated a city in the past 10 turns. So, you get declared war and you get a production bump? Eh, that's whatever. Uh, land down under, plus three housing in coastal cities, pastures trigger a culture bomb, yields from campuses, commercial hubs, holy sites, and theater squares are plus one in terms of charming appeal and plus three in breathtaking. So basically, have really good looking places and then shove down your stuff for adjacency bonuses, which can be really powerful. Uh, they've got a replacement modern era infantry unit. And they have the Outback Station. Unlocks the builder ability to construct an Outback Station unique to Australia. Plus one food and plus one production. Plus one food for each adjacent pasture. Additional food and production as you advance. So they like pastures. They get cultural bombs from them. Allows them to claim a load of tiles real quick. And they also then can just build next to them for adjacency food bonuses. But the best bit is this land down under thing, right? Plus three housing in coastal cities is nice. But the whole plus adjacency bonuses with charming and breathtaking is so good. So we're going to be playing as them. And I'll probably speed up this load screen and I'll catch you in game. Okay, so our start location here is actually pretty good. The one question we have is do we want to settle next to the sea or next to the river? Now obviously like rivers are still better in general, but the sea is almost as good and will be better later when we have an aqueduct. That's the problem. It does also mean we can't settle turn one if we move. If we settle right now, one turn of extra growth, of extra production, that's really good. Uh, right, okay, what do we get? Let's look. We've got diamonds, cattle, which is a pasture, which is culture bomb. That's nice. Fish. Did I say olives already? Olive stone, yeah, okay. Um... One, two, three. So we're over there. One, two, three gets us to diamonds. See, if we go here, we might even get something else in the sea over here. We'd get the olives just. We might get something up here, you know, whatever. Might get something down here, whatever. But we'd also have more housing. I'm, I'm tempted to move, because it also means that we won't suffer flooding, killing off people. It might damage tile improvements, but it won't kill off people, because the city will be next to the sea and not next to the river. I think we do it. It's a tough call. Ooh. We do get access to whales, which is a luxury resource, which is nice. But still not sure if that was the right move. Either way, we're going to send you down here. More pasturing here. Hmm. Uh, we'll straight up found city. Okay, knowledge of sailing's increased. This is a pretty good start. We have... Yeah, three food, one production, one gold as a start tile. Nice. And then backing up, we have two food, two production on each of these. So we'll have production at the same time as growing. So get a scout. 
I mean, to start with, the one production is pretty hurtful, but it will get better. And then research. Uh, I think we want to try and go irrigation. Because, yeah, that way we can get hay and gardens, which will give us increased growth by 15% in all cities and gives us two housing. So I'll go through pottery to get that. And then we can build that on this marsh or something, you know, somewhere that's, eh. More diamonds. Diamonds are really nice. You know, good for gold. I'm less interested in gold mid-game, but right now it would really jump starts a bit. Where's that goody hut? I heard a goody hut sound. Oh, it's here. Oh, it's right next to us. Okay. Hmm. Probably should turn back for that. Right, goody hut, what is it? Please be a builder. Or settler. Populate population. Also a really good choice. Extra two food. Extra two production. Stro solid, straight in there. Don't think I'll even consider changing that. What's up next? Uh, we'll go south. Furs, bananas, a lot of rainforest actually. Might be worth us going to Chichenitsa. Keep me moving. Oh, hello, Fez. We'll get the scout moving north now. Right. How long do we have? Two turns on pottery. Builder might not be a bad idea. Builder to go here requires sailing, though. This requires animal husbandry. Which will culture bomb us, so it will get us a whole load of stuff. But still, uh, that's a quarry. That's irrigation, which we are going for, but... Hmm. Might be worth going an early settler. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm going to go early settler. I know it's going to, you know, take off a person, but we're growing pretty fast. No I'm getting a bit greedy going early play, settler and a wonder. As if there would yeah, be loads of rainforest. By chance and fortune. Right, we did pottery. Oh, hey, a desert. Okay. We're up to three here now. That's another city state. Amber? One, two, three. If we eventually pop four, we could get amber. Hello, Kagura. Oh, there's like literally nothing up here unless we go over the sea. How we did find a new continent. Okay. Well, that was a pretty terrible explore. It's called what? Pangea Ultima? R really? The ultimate continent. Sure. I think we're going to have to go have a proper look around to find somewhere to settle. We've, we've committed to building a settler. No idea where we're putting them. Uh, a lot of production there. Would it be more wise to go for like that? How long till we research? Seven turns. Yeah, yeah, we'll go for the extra growth in the city. Overall, it will be handy. At his best, man is the noblest of all animals. Uh, that's what the coast Separated says. Okay. from law and justice, he is the worst. We'll go foreign trade. Getting trade is never a bad idea. And then we'll go combat when fighting barbarians. And faith in gold. We want to be able to try and get ourselves a pantheon set up. at the end, yeah. Probably should bring you back soon, just in case the barbarians start popping out of the woodwork. 
Settling here someone might not be a bad idea. Decent start location, but our options for actual, like, there we go. Right next door as well. I hate barbarians. They're the worst. Over here doesn't look a bad idea. Salt. Mercury. River. I'm thinking here. Damn barbarian camp. It's going to take us way too many turns to get back there. Um, unpin you. You prefer to do the production? Oh, actually, yeah, no, doing the production makes sense because it actually goes from two turns to one on the settler. Yeah. That's a good call. Yeah. Pretty sure we're settling over here. This is a reasonable. It's not the best, but it's a reasonable. We'd maybe get access to the amber, so if we settled on one of these two. Let's look. One, two, three. One, two, three. We could settle on either of these two. Gotta hope their scout doesn't come down here and grab our settler. The man who has grit enough to bring about the afforestation or the irrigation of a country is not less worthy of honor than its conqueror. Okay. Well, that said, we probably want to go animal husbandry so that we can grab that and culture bomb. We also probably want to start on hanging gardens, which means we want to buy a tile. So, we'll buy that tile. Hang gardens, move the marsh. 23 turns, it says. Okay. That will speed up in 10 when we get another pop. But we'll have to see. Ideally, I'd like to have gold. And then we could buy a builder, improve some tiles, do the thing. You know, culture bombing this will get us uh, more production, I think. Could be wrong though, can't remember what that one is. Then mine this, you know, there are things that we can do. Hell, work this. Civic. Mm, I think we'll go... See, early empire requires a population of six, which we will get, but not immediately. Because when we... We've got three, we're going to found a city. That will go up to two, our three will go up to four. How long is that going to take? 10 turns. Yeah, okay. We'll probably just about do it. It'll be a one turn waste, but it's better than going craftsmanship because this will give us a governor and governors can be pretty handy, especially when they give us extra science or culture. Yeah, it's worth it. Okay. Um, we don't want gold from trade routes or naval era stuff. No. Keep marching. Oh, that became active. Sweet. Oh, this is a nice location. It's not next to... Hmm... Yeah, we want to be next to that river. It's too good to be next to a river. One, two, three. We'd get a second mercury. We'd get a couple of wheat. We'd get the salt. We'd get that. We'd get that mercury. We'd get amber. We'd get fish. One, two, three. We'd also get the other fish. Yeah, it's a good location. It's not mind-blowing to go here, but it's still good. And it's got a mountain that we can use to get buffs to the beauty for our districts. I'm liking that. Yeah, it's a pretty good prospect. We haven't found that many goody huts. Oh, that's where the scout went. Hi there. Really? Barbarians over here? God damn it. We've got to deal with these barbarians quickly. Fond of pigs. 
Dogs look okay, we've got animal us. husbandry. Cats look down on us. Pigs treat us as evil. Oh dear. I will fight that. Because I can't have them coming towards the settler. Like, that would be dreadful for us. Um, we still met another civilization. We could go mining. You know what? We'll go sailing. We probably want to start buffing our stuff at sea first because it's... Well, really good. Um, I'm going to pull back, fortify until healed. Yes, they went the other way. Oh, God, that could have been really bad for us. Uh, and then just boop to there. Attack the scout. Or at least get close to the scout. We'll have to attack it next turn. We should just move to that rainforest there. Hi. Boop. Oh, no, this is Pangaea Ultima. Oh, I thought that was. Well, maybe that is. I don't know. But this is actually a second content. Huh. Fortify until healed. We're blocked by that unit. I'm sorry, but you need to move. You're, you're blocking something very important right now. Start work on a builder. Uh, you should probably just start work on a granary. Like that's always a pretty solid bet. Okay. Go back to building the Hanging Gardens. That distraction was annoying. Attack you. So I'm built a great bath. Okay. It is not that life assured right. destroy you. Good. To me, but life at sea is better. We completed sailing. I mean, I want to do writing, but we haven't met another civilization, so it seems a bit of a waste. I guess we can do mining than writing or something like that, because we're not going to be doing any uh, production of campuses and stuff until we're done with our lovely wonder. Our, our wonderful wonder. Don't know why I didn't just go wonderful, because, you know, kind of in the name. Uh, we're popping over there next. Cool. Okay. So I'm hoping I can sneak in here and just grab that. I really want to be able to get the money from looting the barbarian camp. Oh, hi. Got a promotion. Uh, we're going to keep fortifying. There we go. Aminator of Nubia, all are welcome in our magnificent cities, provided they come as friends. That seems nice. I actually don't know what you are as a civilization. Like, are you a fighty civilization? You seem nice. Right. That's right, so your scout here. When you find yourself in a hole, quit digging. Right, we're gonna run back here, and then we're gonna. Claim that for the money. We get the error score as well. Which is, you know, not to be, uh, not to be knocked. Ugh, still, like, only 8 out of 11 on that error score. Um, with that, though, we will probably just buy the builder. Yeah. Shoes research. Writing. I think we'll take faster movement in... See, we've got a load of woods down here. 
But I'm wondering if this is going to be more mountains, so we'll take the hills. Uh, and then I guess we probably have to send you up here to deal with this one. You got a long walk to go. Oh dear. Right, head up here, grab that pasture, culture bomb. Great. Culture Bomb grabbed everything around it, which is a really nice add-on. Because now we have access to things that are like three food, one production. Hell, if we do the horses, it'll be even better. Uh, you're no longer going there to expand. Okay. Hopefully you'll go for the diamonds. Nah, you won't. Okay, fine. Can we work the horses right now? We can. Okay, now it's three food, two production, which is really nice. I want to go diamonds. But I realize that we aren't grabbing them yet, so instead we'll go all the way back for the fish. Come on, barbarians. Give me a break. Jeez. Also, give me some more goody hearts. Like, I really haven't had my normal, like, set of goody hearts. I've been shortchanged. Writing means sharing. It's part of the human condition to want to share things. Thoughts, ideas, opinions. Okay. Big mountain there. We unlock writing. Um, we could go bronze working, find out where the iron is, which will inform our future city placement. Five turns on hand gardens. I'm so worried now. Oh, we should be fine. Uh, civic. Improve three tiles. We're getting close on that, so yeah, that'll be fine. Build a speciality district. We'll probably get that in time to buff that. And then meet three city-states. Uh, can't guarantee that. Appoint a new governor. Uh, we're going to go for the educator, because he's got an amazing ability. Increase 15% of science and culture. That's nice, but connoisseur and researcher. Plus one science and culture per head. Yes. You're so good. Um, that said, we're good. We're good. Stop threatening my scout. Four turns left. Hungary! Great! What are you, a religious military? Defender of the faithful? Scourge of my foes? I'm a bit worried by that. Um, Don't visit my city. That... Doesn't seem nice. Don't, don't, don't visit my city, please. We've got Pantheon, though. Uh, what do I want for a Pantheon? Plus two amenity and plus two housing to cities if they have a holy site adjacent to a river. Like, that's good. Does restrict our holy site placement a little bit. Plus one great person points from holy sites. That's really nice. Uh, from campuses of a library, theaters. Plus one production from fishing boats. The problem is fishing boats are not everywhere. They're only a few places. Plus one production is... I, I want to say I want to go for it because we're a coastal nation, but also, eh. Um, strategic resource buff. Faith that each barbarian outpost cleared. Everything heals 100. Nice. Uh, bonus faith when killing near a thing. Production towards districts and cities without speciality district. No, they're all kind of... Eh. Better ones are already taken, I think. I'm going to go out and limb and say River Goddess is probably the one we want to go with. Like, Divine Spark is good, though. Plus one great person points. This is a solid bet. Mm, yeah, I'm going to say River Goddess, though. And then we'll have to place our holy site, like, here something. We 
We're going to expand onto that mountain. I guess it's the only two tile away thing. Well, no, we've got river, uh, water here. Oh, okay. All right, path towards craftsmanship. Two turns on the hang gardens. I keep healing. Hello, Hungary. One turn. Promotion available, which is sweet. Oh, hello, Scout. We'll fight it. We've got a buff going on from our culture that helps us against barbarians, so I think we come out on top on that one. Oh, no, don't threaten the me. The ascent to yeah! the high story is by stairs, and at their side are water engines, by means of which persons appointed expressly I do like the these little animations. They're really are neat. continually employed in raising water from the Euphrates into the garden. It's also a pretty nice wonder. Uh, right. A skill without imagination is craftsmanship. Mm, still could do more era score. Useful objects such as wickerwork picnic baskets. Where'd you get the kill with the scout? Right, you need amenities. Okay. Um, well, we need a builder for that. We are working on a builder, but that means we need diamonds or something, right? You're expanding over there. That's not good enough. We can always buy the tile. Uh, I kind of think we want to go campus, though. A six tile. Oh, yes, I want that. Problem is, that, like, I kind of want to use that six because this is probably better used for other stuff. That's six as well, though. And that is just a three food, which is actually one of our lesser tiles. Yeah, let's put a campus down. Um, we don't want to use the builder just yet. We need to wait for some expansion or money to be able to buy these tiles. The immunity is hurting us a bit. But we'll have to do. Yeah, we could maybe grab Mercury or something over here. Ship that over. We need to build it again. Hi there. You're a very rambunctious scout. Bronze is the mirror of the form. Wine of the mind. Just heal you up in place. Right. What I'm going to grab. Astrology. Holy sight. Seems to make sense to me. State workforce is going to be nice to be able to get that governor title straight away. That'll give us, what, five more science? Or oh, five culture. I'm going to go science. Uh, and that'll buff our science to 15. That's scout. I'm going to gonna fight it with my scout. I know my scout's not meant to be doing military fights and stuff. Like, it's meant to be a scout. But also... Oh, hi there. You're a religious one? Hi. It's an honor to meet you. I won't exchange capital information, though. Nope. That seems personal. Oh, God. No, don't go that way. Yeah, Bahrain's are approaching. Let's we'll start hemming you in. Right. You did a good job over here. You did a production. Great. Uh, I'm thinking we go trader. Because that'll set up a road in addition to being, hey, plus one production, plus one food in both cities. The other choice would be, hey, going, you know, Builder, Warrior. We do need the immunity, so going a Builder might not be a terrible idea, but also it's going to take time. We're probably better building a Builder at somewhere else. 
or even just buying one or capturing one if we can. Also, Trader speeds up one of our techs, so we probably should do that. Arabia's conquered the original villain capital of Vilnius. Al already? You were moving very fast there. Do you want to slow down a bit, maybe? A physician without a knowledge of astrology has no right to call himself a physician. Okay, I think we just try and eke you out here. Um, horseback riding? I mean, we could do. I'm not interested in it, though. Celestial Navigation, we haven't buffed in 15 turns, so that's a no. I think we go Archery, just because we're probably not going to build a Slinger. At least not soon. I'm going to back you up into those trees. Give a bit of protection. And then... Trap you in. God damn it. A strong economy begins with a strong, well educated workforce. Um. Okay, it's telling us that the air is nearly over. We did build a campus though. I'll just chase you down. You're going to need to heal up. If we can defeat the Barbarians, that'll give us a bit more error score. We need anything we can get. Uh, we're going to promote you, and we're going to go for science, because this is really going to add... It's not updated yet. Can I get to update somehow? Mm, either way, that's going to go up to, what, 22.2? Which, plus the buffs, is going to go a little bit higher. You've got three turns left on the Builder... You're working on the trader. Do we want to grab the holy site now? No. Yes. No. Maybe. I would want to build the holy site there. There's someone on it. Yeah. We're going to wait. Get off my holy site. No. Still alive. That's annoying. Okay, get off my campus. The forces of evil become confused while your arrow is on its way to the target. Right, you've got one turn left on the builder. I really want to build on diamonds to give us that luxury. Holy site would be six here. It's also a lesser tile. It would take time for the builder to get there. Maybe in that time we can find money by attacking that. I don't know. Look, I've got to have faith in something. Um, currency, make a trade route. That's going to happen soon. No, not soonish. Uh, not actually that soonish at all. Um, look at that. Yeah. Our research is shot up. Mine a resource, build a quarry. I don't really want any of those. I do want to go construction because that will give me access to lumber. And that requires a water mill, which is using the wheels. So we'll do those two. Meet three city-states. I haven't met three city-states. I met two, sadly, because I keep getting attacked by barbarians. I would like to meet more. Seven turns left in the ancient era. That's really not good. I was really hoping for a golden age. I mean, it's fine. I'm not going to get a golden age. It just makes me sad. What are we working right now? Uh, sure. Gonna need to heal more. Don't 
Don't reinvent the wheel. Just realign it. Okay. If I stand next to you, I can get you to attack me and then profit? I don't know. Look, I'm working with a very limited idea set here. I was really hoping to get a golden age straight off the bat, but maybe it was just hoping too much. Oh, we maybe could do this. I think if we heal for one turn, we might be okay. And you spawned a... Yeah, of course he did. Also, you're going to pillage that. That's going to make me really sad. The scout could well kill the warrior after this. Oh. I'm after being attacked by someone. When wasteful war shall statues overturn. Right, we got the Eriscore. We got the money. Out the work of masonry. 21 out of 25 for the error score. We can pop that. Mine it. Which gets us the amenity. I think building the holy site might just do it. I'm going to make a risk as well. I'm going to send the scout out because I want to try and maybe find someone. You know, get that third city-state. Uh, how long till we make that trade route? One turn. Yeah, okay. We'll do the currency thing. I think we've got this in the bag. Because Ancient Era is going to end in one turn. Okay, I think we're just going to be shy. Set up a route to Canberra. Boost that, which would get us Era score normally. We're going to be just caught out on this one. Damn it. Fine. Right, what do I want to produce? Um, it's probably going to be like a war or something. And unless we wanted to go for an extra, no, extra set would come off camera. You know, the production here to do it quickly enough. Um, you've got no good tiles for that. Holy site, no good tiles for that. Yeah, maybe maybe like an archer or something. Just to keep people like a little scared. Or we could just go for a monument. You know what, monument, yeah, we need the culture. Shoo, cool. And you did wreck my fishing boats. And we went in the classical era. We only entered with a normal era bonus. Ugh, I was really hoping for the golden age. Makes me sad. Oh well. What do we want to go for? Gain plus one error score each time you trigger Eureka. Plus one error for constructing a building that provides science as a base yield. That's probably what we want to go for. I'm thinking we go science. Um, we could go religion. But I don't know if people around here are going religion. Yeah, I'm thinking for inquiry is probably the way to go here. And then rely on that and just try and go full up, max out science, go science victory, probably. In the meantime, you need to heal. And you, yeah, should probably heal more. We didn't get that many goody hearts, which is probably why our era score was a little bit lower than I was hoping for. But oh well. Yeah, we only found the one pasture as well. I was hoping we could find a couple more. Honestly, we need to think about setting up a third and probably a fourth settlements at this stage. And I don't know where they're going to go. I haven't seen any good candidates. Maybe we need to have a look over here. That's a river. Technically, that would be a sea river area. Maybe over here or potentially over here if this is the other side of the continent. 
But right now, this as a location is already kind of taken by someone. And this is unknown. So we'll have to think about it. Obviously, if we do go down here, a lot of rainforest just needs to be a good choice. So I think now before we go, I'm going to rename some cities because uh, this is where I shall I have a Patreon. Um, I let people support me on Patreon and when they support me, I take the names and I put them to a name list. And so we're going to name the cities after people on the name list. So that's going to be Blue Nexus. And this is going to be Scenic. Not Scenic. Think of science. Scenic Giant. There we go. You ruined my fishing boats. Mad about that. Hope they move on and never come back, but you know, can't guarantee that one. Uh, how are you doing for amenities? You're fine. You're fine. You've got 10 housing there, which is really nice. 10 housing here as well. Like, just so good. Anyway, we're going to call it there for today. Hopefully you liked it. If you have, uh, like, subscribe, etc. You know the drill. Um, also, do give me a comment down below, especially because I haven't played a lot of Civ for quite a while on the channel. So knowing if you'll enjoy watching, etc. If you're enjoying the theories, if you're enjoying the choice of civilization, that's all really good feedback. And uh, I would appreciate it also because YouTube requires comments to do its algorithm stuff uh, but also um, I will leave the New Frontiers Pass link down below since I mentioned that uh, which is from the sponsor video if you do want to go check that out you can do so um, but yeah I've been Andrew Lissium hope you've enjoyed until next time stay shiny